Exciting times. Liverpool versus Megalodon. Two Titans of the North. Are you commentating? I am commentating. I'm excited. Let's I know go, like, about half of both teams. Uh, looking at the Liverpool lineup, I'll start with the Beatles because I know them both. Nathaniel Wellen, Will, get Will Jacobs. Will Jacobs, my uh, teammate from Mermaid during QPL. Corey Kelly Weeks in the uh, green headband. Yeah, I will definitely doing that. Quality waffle player there. <laughs> Yes, I am. Chloe Hemingway. And then I don't know the other two chasers that may have been This is generally Liverpool is, I think, um, a very good side. Uh, good teamwork, good synergy, um, and lots of good individual skills. And I think sometimes it takes some people by surprise. We don't have any as many of the kind of big, um, famous Scottish names. And speaking of which, if we look at the Moon Mags lineup, we have a very famous player, Tom Haynes. Playing in a keeper headband <laughs> for Mex. Either Sam Burkett and Mel Piper lined up for Mex. Connor Climo going for the. Oh, a very fast lap. Connor Climo and Tom Hutton on the chase line. This is going to be interesting. There we go. Moves up. Sam Burkett clattered, but Megs are in there. Oh, fumble from Tom, Hay Tom uh, Hutton. Liverpool ball. Yeah. Megs using that speed, but didn't manage to convert. Looks like they do have control though after that little scrap. What do we look at Liverpool going to do about this? Emily. In case we turn this way. Thank you. <laughs> Nice and patient from Liverpool. Ooh, beats her. Oh, beats her. Oh, it's not called. Um, very patient from Troy, trying to set up his offense. Amazing controls not to be trifled with. Very close to the edge there. Ooh. <laughs> 67 is way too close to Troy. I'm not sure. Who's the snitch? Liverpool have, have gained control on loose boots. Sam Burkett now on the defensive trying to screen from the down level. <laughs> Will Jacobs moving in, going for the attack on Mel Piper, I think. Sitting at the pincer, Wills creep round. Very good. Beat on Mel Piper, no bludgers. And Troy missed it, it was a bit slow. No good, no good. Second too slow there with the attack. Meg's beaters way up ahead of their chasers. Probably a little bit hasty. So two dangerous quick chasers on the Ooh, Miss Beat. Not well impressing Tom Haynes, not going too far, that's smart. Doesn't have the support. Good beat from Sam Burkett. Nails will. Beats not well and Ooh, Sam Burkett's cleaning up. And Tom Haynes takes advantage of that and scores. A little bit more coordination for those of them will be just Sam Burkett right on top of uh, <laughs> Troy Kelly Leeds, but to no avail. Liverpool <laughs> <laughs> so with control, moving the clock a lot, pass the center line. Ooh, missed beat from Neil Piper, goes for a good pass, fumble, oh. Tom Hutton, Chloe Hemingway fighting for it. Chloe's pick it up. She is scrapped. Oh, but she's not. Loose. And that's boundary for Megs. Yeah, Megs ball. Liverpool really need to up their game on the attack here. Um, the Megs offense is almost irresistible, so they really can only hope to go toe to toe. If they keep messing up these attacks, it's not going to be a great game. Baptism much better. Liverpool with control. Tom Haynes taking his time. Let's push the tempo, please. No, that's it. Connor, you need to be moving around more, pal. Oh, nice try. Mel attempts to stop. Ooh. Good goal. Good goal, good. No. So anyway, taking the ball up. That's a good move there. She's clear. And... Out. Nice Troy's two oh, good shot from Troy. And Liverpool retain control. That's more what we need to see from Liverpool. 
score is 2010. 2010. Phil Brown on in front of so new Meg's Beater lineup. Phil Brown and Francesca Vigilante, I believe, ex York players. They know each other well. Should see some synergy. Good physical housing from Phil. Oh, good beat from Fran right on the foot. And that was not expecting that. Oh, Phil's going to destroy. Oh, that was a lucky one in. I think it was in. Yeah? Okay, it looked like it fell right through the hole. Chloe pulls uh, the Meg's chase to the ground, but. Oh, it's still not, not called good. Okay, brings down the ref to the Was this called good? No good, it's still 2010 there. Very, very complicated. I like when Connor's here. So, Meg's with control. Fran and Phil up quite high. Try and scare off that uh, Liverpool attack. What are Will and Nat going to do about this? Troy is lurking behind those beaters. Phil's, Phil's coming up aggressively. Nat's the beater that prefers to duel. No more likely to duel. No more likely to duel. No more likely to duel. I want to fuck you. Phil's not allowed to play. Still no movement. Low scoring game here. So you choose to stay the Liverpool offense. They cannot go back behind either of the restricted lines. Either the keeper line right now and the soon as throw past the halfway cannot reset past that. Alright, he's past the halfway line. He's in a box. He's been pushed. That's fine. He's been pushed off. He's too early. Being hassled still by the Meg's chaser. Okay, makes a draft and Very high positioning for Max. They've got two up, with two beaters, but the beaters are not being as aggressive as you'd expect using this formation. So what is what is Phil and Fran gonna do? Taken out by Phil. There they go, but both teams closing the line. Nice clinical there. Nice pass off from Tom Haynes to Tom Hutton, who's open on the little hoop. Easy goal. 30 10. Chris, Chris, he's a bit offside. Was it offside? Offside. So here, this makes defense. We have two chases up front opposing the quaffle. The beaters are lurking close behind. Oh, nice easy tap of the Liverpool chaser. <laughs> Jay Holmes of Bless Rock is shouting admonitions from his uh, Ooh. Ooh. Troy is down. Trying to come clear. Tom Hunt is beat. Will need to move quicker. Now the Meg's chaser is beat. Unclear. So basically, the gist of it is Liverpool's offense is very slow. Not really creative enough to get past Megs. Megs are just chasing the Sounds Oh, yellow card for Will Jacobs. Something happened here. What was your yellow for? Knacking no, the ball back and there was a turnover, but um, I, I ignored it, didn't hear the turnover thing. So. Oh, goal still not good. They did not manage to score despite that, and Liverpool held on. Scrappy, tenacious defense from Liverpool, keeping them in this game. They are not out of range, they are still in range, so this isn't the worst. You need to be patient to get their other beater back on. Losing a beater down is always critical. Yes. 
very patient from Liverpool. Now, and that needs to be a bit more creative. For this. At least takes the out. Or at least cover your, your keeper. Good defense, good block from that. A little scrappy fills off room. But Phil should be back to me. <laughs> okay, Sean's let him on, but okay. Thanks, if we get in the quaffle. Oh, Fran beating out Liverpool. Chase is left right in the centre. No, no, spoon down, spoon down, we'll wait. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yellow card to keeper target. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Liverpool have two players in the Sinmin now. Only four on pitch versus Megs is six. If Megs doesn't score in the next five seconds, that will be disappointing for Megs. Let him go. He's in. Uh, oh, spoiled. Phil takes out Nat, but loses the bludger. He's going to beat Will to it. No, Will Jacobs gets the bludger. Good hit from Phil, wrapping up Will. But Will has fought him off. Marshall! Fran and Nat on the floor. There's a bludger behind. He doesn't have it! He doesn't have it! What? Ashara, that's not right. I'm not a ref in this game, but that was a bad call. Ashara, he didn't have it. Yeah, but Jesus, Jesus calling the right, making the right call here. Come on, Liverpool. Lucky shot there. Yeah. 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 Oh, really? Ah, really? Oh, man. Refs are not paying attention here. So there, apparently there was a, a beat that I missed because I was too busy playing for paying attention to the other beat of the fights. It was whoever the uh, keeper was. Right, yeah. So the keeper was beat, who also made the, the shot. So probably the goal will be disallowed. Now. So maybe still 30 10. This is a very low scoring game. But I would have expected it more from May. This yeah, the Megs, the Megs defense is very, very, very high um, on the pitch, um, but they're not really causing the turnovers that you would expect from, from such a formation. Liverpool actually still have control at this point as well. Maybe we can watch Jesus remonstrating with Ashara. To be fair to Ashara, it's just I think he didn't see where the, the bludgers were and was reacting to what was on the pitch. But Jesus is right in this case. Phil did not have the name of the we start. Quaffle with Megs. And the goal score. Is the goal is kept good. All right. So Liverpool is still in this game, despite all appearances. Let's see if Mace can punish them for now. Mel Piper back on pitch, trying to hassle Nat. Well, um, ooh, good block from Will Jacobs. But both have gone after. Ooh, lots of exchanges here, but no real actual beating. Good beat from Sam Burkett, good beat from Will Jacobs. Liverpool remain contained control. I think the confidence of both these teams has somehow just fallen disappeared. <laughs> Maybe. Maybe. Just go like a little bit left. Thanks. Yeah, nice and slow. Troy Kelly weeks with big waffle. Thinking about a shot, but it's quite far out. Tom Hutton beat. Another chase of beat. Come on, this is your chance. Drive for the ooh. Tom Haynes just knocks that quaffle out of uh, Troy's hands, stopping that attack. Tom Haynes really solid, uh, really keeping legs together. Good block for Danny Willem. He's still on Tom Haynes. That Liverpool keeper is tall. Should be winning this. He does flesh that. Liverpool beaters still with control. Not making the most of it. 20 to Max. Oh, Dickinson on pitch now. 
Beat, oh, good beat from Will Jacobs, takes out Meg's only bludger. <laughs> the chasers are hassling, Primer's been beat. Now the keeper's been beat. Yes, tight, lad! Pitch it up, tight, lad! Good pitch awareness from that one, comes off back onto the defense immediately. Even though, uh, this is Time check. Time check, please. I think Liverpool beaters need to be using their physicality against this particular lineup. What's your opinion of the referee? <laughs> <laughs> well, I've already like shouted at the shower for some some fairly badly missed calls. There was also probably another miss. Uh, Stop that, please, Jan. Thank you. That is I know. Oh. I did actually hit the bludgeon. Yeah, I know, but I'm going to agree with my team. I look like. <laughs> Throw his feet, something's moving up, and that's safe. Too high. Too high. Beat Will Jacobs. Oh, it's not called. Uh oh. Matt Will and Beat, didn't realize yet, could have called immunity. Missed Beat, oh, now he's Beat. No bludgers, Will Jacobs with the pleasure, but Connor Klein was way too fast for him. Good pass off. We need to see more of this from Megs. This is what we'd expect. The score is now 40 20 to Megs. <laughs> Liverpool now looking a bit dazed. Okay, club going on with Matt Willem. Very low will be the pair. Now they're up against the York, the former York leaders from Megs. Bill and Fran again. <laughs> <laughs> the run with decent range, very fast as well. And quite happy to get physical contact. Tough beater to deal with. Fran Vigilante going for the press. Wow, the other beaters are occupied. Smart move. Fran releases. She can see the front of the way. Knocks that ball up. Chris Dishington pick it up. Challenge beat out. Challenge beat. Oh, they pulled the game control. And the attack still limps on. I don't believe that Tom Haynes is subbed yet. I think it'll be interesting to see what happens if he subs off with a little and take advantage of that. What do we put the game in our real Tom Haynes is taking the point. Unable to be beat out because he's a keeper. Ooh! Good block from Connor Climber. That's an unexpected shot from Troy Kelly Weeks. Ooh, ooh, that was nearly coming from behind. Nat Wellham takes out Tom Haynes. Troy goes in. Oh, great block from uh, Tom Haynes. Troy needs to stop with these shots. They're not, they're not going through. Climber drags Troy to the ground. He can't see anymore. Oh, Troy's still on his feet. Good shot. Maybe, maybe I am wrong and Troy should keep going with the shots. Oh, sneaky beat from Fran Vigilante from behind. But Cloud go and takes her out and goes for the bludger. Phil Brown's chasing after him to take him out. Keep control. Oh, nearly caught by Cloud going. Cloud's running back to Duke. Good slow attack from me. Time was what? Oh. Wow, that was actually quite quick. So we are still in. This is going to be a slim game. Unless things change very, very, very rapidly in the next three minutes, we are probably going to see a game where both teams are in range of even six points from each other, more than 30 points from each other. The game will totally transform into a beater seeker game at that point. Yeah, oh, messy, messy offense from Megs there. Shannon looks to be injured, he's, he's on his knees. Springs down. Thank you. 
Can I get some space, please? That is Tom Charles injured, number 20. He's back on. He's chasing feet. He's looking to keep his ball. He's trying to call a timeout. Oh, Liverpool come well equipped with some water and a carrier. That's nice. Both heavy on the offense. Both teams. Yeah, it's, it's surprising. I don't really. I've seen both teams play before. Normally, a lot more energy from both sides. Like they're fairly in contact. It's not like that much running around. It's not like the um, this is always the worst for our viewers when uh, there's a stoppage. So I'm trying to think of what we can talk about to keep things interesting. But nothing, nothing comes to mind straight away other than this is a, a slow game. Yeah, I feel Glasgow really need to while they have their talk, they really need to talk about just uh, uh, the alarm's lines and stepping it up, even if it's just, even if it's, even if it's little things, like um, um, just making sure you don't, don't get pushed back by your point. Because yeah. 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 time and time again, um, Meg's um, point there is just uh, pushing them back behind the halfway line. And also supporting each other. I think both like more on the Liverpool side, but you can kind of see like Chase is bunched up rather than kind of being in space yeah. and make sure they're open for a receipt in case that that point is asked in the bottom pair. They should be able to get it free. Let's see if that team talk changes anything for either team. But yeah, I hope we see a bit more tempo now. I hope to see Liverpool just play with a bit more space and... And that one of them off. Ooh, new on. Some very uh, savage uh, face painting on. War paint. Yeah, war paint. Men's a really drop back to so they Men seem to have abandoned their uh, high 2-2 defense. Full ground coming in. Yeah. 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 This is what we need now. Now there should be some pressure. Goes over to Ricks, but Ricks is beaten by. Next had the ball, and this should be over. And it scores now 50 30 to Megs, but it's probably not going to be enough to get them out of range because this comes on. It's 16 50. 16 50. 10 seconds. Seekers, Megs. Thank you, Charlotte. Now, well, I'm back on. Liverpool have at least regained budget control, which actually in this scenario is probably more important than that last goal that Tom Haynes managed to sneak past them. Um, they're still uh, only 20 down. And we've got our Claudio is snitching. Looks like Troy coming on in climb up. Some this would be interesting. Some very nippy but surprisingly strong seekers. Against Claudio who is a snitch who probably relies more on speed and agility than Claudio, five, four, and snitch range. This could be a snitch is on pick. But Menzo just scored another one, I think. 60 30. Can Menz pull it out of range? Liverpool needs to last down. They're going to have a home. 
Okay, here we go. Will Liverpool strategy be to slow it down and try and catch for overtime? Or are they going to push? Hopefully gain that one extra goal to end this game now. Let's see what their strategy is. 30 seconds, Seekers! Liverpool just lost control, not great. 30, 20 right, sorry, seconds now. Clothing, right. so pull out. Oh, big hit from Tom Haynes. Debrews the Liverpool keeper. Right. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Release. Stop. Brings down. There's a huge pile. Someone looks injured. Is that Lauren? This is a. Uh, uh, it was it 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 that last one was a <laughs> Fine, thank you, thank you. So actually, it looks like that last goal was called no good. So that makes goal no good. Score is 50 30 to make. Okay, so it's 50 30. This is, it is uh, a swim game. Right, this is swim. Both beating teams need to forget about the quaffle at this stage. It also means then for chasers, bodies on the line because you really don't have beaters to support you in defense. And it looks like that may have been what happened down at the next goal. Ian Keenan makes his debut on the pitch today from Mex. Um, very solid beater. Playing on the X Men roster. Number 32, Meg's Chaser, has been replaced by number 35. Back on. No, it was called no good before, apparently. Yeah. So this is on. Shrimp. Beat. And there's Hassel and Claudio big time. So he's beat. Climo has time on his own. He's beat. Oh, Climo has ended this very quickly. I think that was Climo. Uh, that was way too short. So, a long 17 minute game and mere seconds of snitch on pitch time. Connor Climo. Rightly well, famous for a season. <laughs> that was done. That is done. I thought he was probably disappointed with that performance. Game's over. Thanks, guys. Wow. That is 9 star 30 tonight. RP. 9 star 30 tonight.